Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Do not mind that. Um, that was a mess up. But we're gonna, I'm gonna teach you how to spawn things and get beings and get guns, get ammo, and everything you need to know about quick play. So what you're gonna wanna do is you're going to want, hold on guys, you're gonna want to hit enter. Now you have the options to hit continue or maybe uh, campaign and there's going to be a button called quick play now you're going to hit quick play might take a second to load but wait a second now we're going to spawn in this area as you can see this whole area now on your left joystick there's going to be a joystick right here which is going to help you move around now on this side there's gonna be a joystick that teaches you how to um, how to look around. So you move it around like this, like to the side left and down. You can crouch with it if you move it down. You can um, you can kind of uncrouch with if you move it up. Now, if you want to jump, you're gonna have to hit A. Um, but let's get to the chase now. So you see that table over there? We're gonna want to walk over there, like this. Doo -doo -doo, doo -doo -doo -doo. Now, this tool right here, I'm gonna show you this tool in a little bit, but this tool basically can move things around and fling things and delete things, I believe. No, no, this one deletes, I believe. But um, what you're gonna wanna do is hit B. B. If it works. Yes, and then you're gonna see a button called Utilities. You're gonna have all these, but you're gonna hit Utilities. Now you will have all these options, and you're gonna wanna hit Beings. Now this is where you basically can spawn um, living things. Now, tr personally, the crablets are annoying. They're like things that crawl on your face. The no bodies attack you with, with that, whatever they have or their hands. Now Ford, he is a nice guy, but if you fight him, he will not, he will start fighting you back. Now Ford right here can uh, get, you can shoot him, you can bang him in the face with a ax, you can do whatever. Now punch him, you see? You can punch him. Now, that might work, but you know what else you can do? Grab this. Now you're gonna spawn a new Ford. He's gonna get up. But uh, you're gonna go back to utilities. Now you're gonna have the options to hit guns. Or if you're back here at spawnables, you'll just hit gun. Now if you go to gun, you will have all these uh, things. Uh, all these uh, choices. Now, personally, I like the 1911 or the shotgun the most, I believe. Yeah, that's a shotgun. Now, what, you wanna, what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna wanna go to ammo. Now, ammo is the one thing you need for these guns. Now, the shotgun is gonna need hem, heavy ammo, heavy ammo. Now, the pistol is gonna need ammo box light. So, let me show you how it works. So you're gonna grab this, you can grab them to equip them. Now, I'll show you the pistol because it's a li little bit less amusing, but now you see him? You can shoot him, you can hold it like that by crab uh, grabbing it like this on the bottom. Now you can aim. Now you have to pull this back to load it, but after that, you can aim at it shoot him. Now how you reload is you take your hand like this, go up down here, pull out another ammo. Now if you have every sort of ammo, uh, you have to hold the gun to get the exact ammo for the gun. Now you see Ford, I'm going to use you. Now you can, can reload as long as you want, as much as ammo you have. Now the shotgun is a bit cooler because you're going to you have to grab shotgun shells from your side, but remember, it's heavy ammo, and the, uh, the 1911 is um, light ammo. Now you can load it, 
but sometimes you will stop reloading it when it's full of ammo. Now what you're gonna do is grab this, pull it back. Oh, that was not good. You do that. Now you can aim it at your target. How about, I'm gonna let you live for a little bit because I have to test some stuff on you. Now you can aim it at anything you want. Uh, I'll probably aim it there. You can aim it like a normal gun. Hold it like this. You can do freestyle. You can do upside down like this. Upside down like this. Or trick shot. Hold on. I suck at trick shots, just saying. Yeah, I suck at trick shots. Um, and you can throw it up if you know how to do tricks. Now you can do a little spin. Bow. But I'm out of air. I'll do that trick real quick. You can spin around. Do a spin. Sorry, that one was a bit late. Do a spin. There we go. Now, now to the, the swords. Swords are pretty quiet, I'd say. Um, so you go back to utilities by hitting B. Now, you have a variety in blades. You'd hit blades. Now we have the firefighter axe, we have the dagger, and we have the best of sword. These are kind of medieval stuff. Now, blunts are baseball bats, hammers, and crowbars. Now I'm going to spawn a couple beings so we can test them. Now, let's start with the axe. You can bend down like I told you earlier and you can chop his legs. And you can get the bat, hold it down here. Pop him in the head. Pop him in the head. How's it going? And we're gonna grab your dead body and bring you over here. Now we got the dagger, which is pretty cool because you can hold it upside down like a stabbing. Now. That's it for the, you can stick it like that. Now we're gonna move on to the bastard sword, which I believe is the coolest out of all the blades. I go, ah! And see, like I told you earlier, he will fight back. Hi -ya. Now that's it for the bastard sword. Now we can try the crowbar. I believe that the crowbar is not that cool. Oh, you want to fight? Okay. We'll use the hammer. The hammer's pretty cool. So, yeah, they all work pretty cool. Now, yeah. Uh, where did I throw that thing earlier? I threw it over here. Did I really throw it down? Oh, yeah, it's over there. Now we're going to spawn a Ford. Now, time to move on to this thing that I was talking about earlier. I forgot what it was called. What you can do with this is you can grab stuff with it. Oh, oh, crap. And you can grab stuff with it and fling it like that. Grab this guy because he doesn't want to live, I guess. Legs probably hurt, not to lie. Now we can fling them against the wall. And we can do a whole bunch of things. Now, I'm going to end this series by doing this. See, 
you guys. Hopefully I helped you. Thank you for watching. And please subscribe.